everybody. God bless you. I know people are logging out right now. We are live from Hawaii. Aloha. Hawaii Aloha. Glory Convergence. It's, of course, uh, one of your favorite people, myself, Dr. Ben Lim, and Evangelist Robbie Dawkins. Listen, uh, I don't know, of course, most people watching uh, on my page. Maybe you don't know who this man of God is, but, I mean, he's an incredible evangelist, huge hunger uh, to see souls won and to activate the church. And he's doing some incredible stuff right now in Afghanistan, the Middle East, maybe some with Gene Bailey uh, with Flashpoint. Uh, but, uh, you know, we love you, and you're here. And last time was great, incredible. And the theme of this year's conference is uh, Glory Harvest. You know, and of course, Prophet Charlie was shackled, supposed to be here, but, you know, he got sent back home. So just talk to us real quick about, you know, what you're sensing in this season, and then share the dream. Yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, this is a season of equipping, this is a season of preparation. But uh, my pastor actually called me. Yeah. I was on the plane heading here, and he had had a dream. He was Pastor Chris McCray from Southern Church in Carrollton, Texas. And he made the comment, uh, he said, he said, I saw you swimming in the ocean. And he goes, you were on a surfboard. And he goes, and I saw all these sharks circling you, and they were wanting to come wow. after you and wanting to get you. And, and we've been going through some, you know, with what we're doing in Afghanistan and throughout the Middle East, of course, you know, you're not going to do stuff like that without, out of, without yeah. encountering some warfare yeah, yeah. and some opposition. Uh, the enemy doesn't like that stuff. But um, he's like, I see these sharks circling, and they're wanting to come after you. They're wanting to come and get you. And he goes, but but they're not able to. You're just kind of swimming right through them, and they're not they're not touching you. They're not coming after you. And he goes, I felt like there was different forms of attacks of the enemy. And then as he's saying this, Ben, I'm sitting there going, no, this is exactly where you know, some things that we've been battling through and going through. And all of a sudden, uh, he said, I, but I saw this other surfer who was standing on their board. Their face was illuminated. And he goes, and instantly when I saw them, I knew this was a heavenly being. He goes, I, my sense was that it was an angel. And he said, and you looked at him and nodded, speaking of me, looking at him and nodded, and then he nodded. And then I stood up on my surfboard and all of a sudden, there was one of these tunnel waves that you catch. And he, uh, we both got in the wave. He said, you led the way. And then he was following and pursuing. And he says, man, you were touching the walls and the water. And you were experiences. And he goes, but that wave was shooting you faster and, and beyond. And he goes, there were other surfers that were getting ahead of you before that. But he said, but uh, this one just shot you out. And as we were just talking, it was like a portal. Like yeah. A trans, uh, you know, being translated in yeah, many yeah. ways and being propelled forward in many ways. And he said, you came out on the other side, you went further. He said, when you, when you came out on the other side, he goes, I noticed you were stronger. I noticed there was all these wow. things. Through. And I, as I was hearing this, and I, I, man, I felt the Holy Ghost all over me. Man, I was just getting those you know, those Holy Ghost bumps all over, uh -huh. all over as he's talking about this. And he's had another significant uh, dream he and his wife both have in the past. So I knew to pay attention to wow. it. But I had the sense that we are all sort of in that place of shark infested waters. Mm. There are things that are coming wow. at us. There's opposition. There's issues in family. Let me tell everybody right now, right now, you want to bind and break the spirit of confusion. There's a spirit of confusion yes. that's being released. Yeah. It is. Yeah. I just read that this morning mm -hmm. relating to the wow. Leviathan and yeah. how, the, oh, how that it works. Yeah. And I, I hadn't read about the Leviathan in a while wow. as far as uh, demonic and principality type stuff. But all of a sudden, it, it just this, this constricting uh -huh. like that is. And what's interesting is one of the people close to me, they were going through a thing of shortness of breath. Yeah. Uh -huh. And, and they yeah. were like, what's going on with that? And, 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 Yet when we prayed as a team and broke the spirit, all of a sudden yeah. their breathing came back. And their, but then when they would be tempted to go back into the spirit of confusion, yeah. they would start having issues with their breath again. So this was wow. clearly a demonic thing. Well, I'm being reminded right now, sharks are marine spirits, which oh. is Leviathan. Wow. And marine spirits have to do with water, and that's where there's murkiness, there's lurkiness, there's confusion. Yeah. So Leviathan or sharks or octopus, etc. These are marine spirits. Wow. Now, which have to do with the waters, uh, the waterways, etc. So, 
So we have to be aware of yes. what we drink, you know, marine spirits. And this, and there's also somehow there's a connection in this too with the Jezebel spirit. Yeah. Because the Jezebel spirit comes to seek to kill the prophets oh, yeah. and to take out the voice wow. of God and to make you question hearing from God. I mean, you know, these people, they, they, they clearly had clear words from God wow. and things. And then the enemy tries to come and steal that and go, ah, uh, you think you made yeah. a mistake? Ah, uh, I think you went off. And they start doubting whether they even heard the sure. Lord. Okay. That, that's a Jezebel spirit because it's jealous of the spirit of God. And it's also jealous of the prophets because it wants to kill the voice of the prophets. I'm telling everybody, be aware of this Oof. in this time. But get in that angelic, that yeah, heavenly come on. tube, that Jesus, portal. Wow. Be in that place in the presence where you're surrounded wow. by the worship and the word. Yes. And break those things because these are attacks. They're coming through governments. They're coming through every sort of system right now in the world. And notice with even this COVID mm -hmm. that is happening, it's a restriction of the breath. And wow. this is something that wow. God, come on. Yes, God gave us his breath. Come on. He the released yes. into... Uh, you know, by saying his uh, very name, Yahweh, which is to breathe in and breathe out, he released that breath, and the enemy is coming after that to take that. And so be on guard, be on watch, don't be fearful, but keep moving forward. And that wow. was the thing my pastor kept saying, but he said, you just kept moving forward, you didn't back off, you didn't, and he goes, and you didn't let it make you get worried or fearful. Shut up. And so come against that. I just wow. even pray that for yeah, anybody come who's on. watching yes. right now where you've been battling that, to battle and fight against that Leviathan, mm. that spirit of confusion, Eat that up, spirit up. of Jezebel that's yes. coming against you. I'm not saying that it's it's you having that Jezebel. It, it, but yeah. you may, but it can be coming that trying to control you because oh, Jezebel so tries to control yes. the spirit of God and it tries to control the men and women of God. So we break that, yes, Lord. bind that by the authority of Christ. Be aware of it, and even pray over yourself that you broke it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that is being broken and Come released wow. as we're in this wow. conference here. Wow. I can feel that this breaking because there's been a constriction over a white. Uh, it's yeah, been oh yeah, constricting oh, yeah. over a yeah. white. So God's on the move. Get on uh, God's wagon and don't get off. And, and pretty, much, I mean, your pastor had that dream and texted you that dream. Sent that. As you were on the plane flying here, yes, not knowing you were coming, coming to Hawaii. To this. So Amen. it's a it's a corporate prophetic Absolutely. word, but it's also a personal prophetic word for you because if you felt like you were surrounded by sharks who want to eat you alive, chew you up, kill you, steal, destroy, uh, manipulate, etc., but get ready for the angelic encounter because there was an Come angel on. there yeah. that showed you the way and that thrusted you through the portal. Get ready for angelic visitations. Get ready for uh, angels to visit you in your dream and your vision. God's going to meet you afresh, and you're going to go through the tunnel Amen. afresh. And do you know how hard it is to surf through the, the tube tunnel? I mean, I don't even know the right word of it, right? The right term. But, I mean, as evangelists were in the dream, you surfed through, and you were ahead of everybody, which is a spirit of acceleration. So, man, God's going to thrust you forward, church, and I'm so glad that dream was released because I received that for myself Amen. personally. It yeah. was powerful. It was wow. powerful. Everyone hearing it, just bear witness, receive, and apply that to yourself. Well, my goodness. Listen, as my son, Dr. Bentham, and Evangelist Robbie, we love you. Uh, Evangelist, uh, we're so glad you came. Just it's connect you heart to heart. We just appreciate you so much. And what you're doing in the Middle East. I love the Middle East, you know. Uh, Isa al and, <laughs> yeah. uh, and But, you know, Oh, God is so good. God is so good. But listen, um, Evangelist Robbie is going to be ministering live now on YouTube. Afternoon, we have Prophet Charlie Shamp. He's going to do Zooming in at 2 p.m. Hawaii time. And in the evening, I'm going to be closing. I love you. This is Dr. Ben Lim. Get ready to finish this year as he translates transition through the tunnel, the portal of God's glory. This is Ben Lim with Evangelist Robbie Doctors from Hawaii Glory to Perkins. Aloha, and we'll see you soon.